after creating this master uh, table i'll import the remaining table from this excel sheet where i have already created these tables so what i will do to import these tables simply in sql server right click on the database tasks import data and the source of the data is the excel and uh, i'll browse here is my file in this file i have uh, so many sheets uh, about five to seven so this is the destination sql server my local host and windows authentication this is the database name where the data is going to and this is the database name where the data is going to import so next so i can uh, select this option already default selection because we are uh, fetching or importing data from the existing table you can also uh, get data using s query so because we are transferring data from the table so this is this selection is good next you can see here i have a few tables in uh, same in the in the different sheets of the same file so first of all i'll take the gender table and you can also edit here the data types so gender id is my id is integer and uh, So gender ID is integer. I'll keep their int or gender var chart, var chart, and gender ID maximum male, female, and transgender. So we can give it up to the 10. Okay. Next. Ignore. Ignore. And next. Next. Finish. Transfer. One was the male, female, and transgender closed. Successfully, I have imported gender table. So rename to remove the string. And you can see we have imported gender table so design and give this a set primary key to this column save so tbl gender so the name of tbl gender it is it uh, the name this name i gave this name and the tbl gender the name was given to this table already in my excel sheet so the gender id would be the primary key and the gender is it's the name of the gender id so i can also see here the data stored in the gender table male female transgender so two tables another table to import right click task and import data excel browse artist file next destination is the sql server local host and database is the dpr test next and then district table edit mapping so here in teacher i want to keep it in then district is what chart training 
and province ID in. Okay. Next, ignore. Ignore. Next. Next. Print. So, I have one forty six image successfully that are transferred from SQL to the SQL server. Right click in database, refresh. And see the table district so rename remove the string right click on district design set primary to this table uh, set primary key to this column and this save over the same name district table district and close so three tables we have Got in this database. So similarly, I'll import all the tables from T to this database one by one. 